What it do, ladies and gentlemen? Look at these three siblings. Right here is off of Guap and Barbie. Champ Lucky Luciano meets Spartacus 2 meets 1X Hollywood meets uh, Louis V Lines Louis V. I have the mail available to the left. He's 3K. ABKC paper. Three months. Uh, pie, lilac. Pie Ball Try. Uh, all of them try. All of them's lilac. Even this little all white female in the middle. She's just a Pie Ball Lilac Try. Uh, uh, the sire is Guap. He's Pie Ball. He's a Venus son. And the dam is Barbie. I just showed her to Indiana. She's a Louis V. Lines Hollywood daughter. She's an all lilac try. Um, uh, uh, she's a Ritz uh, granddaughter, which uh, Ritz carries piebald, and that's where the piebald gene came from. Um, because uh, Barbie's damn, um, no, I take that back. Barbie's damn did uh, uh, produce uh, a piebald, two two piebalds. Um, but um, that's because I bred her to, uh, but but I uh, bred her to Ritz, her damn, uh, uh, Barbie's damn's damn. Barbie's damn, damn, cause Barbie's damn, Barbie's damn is Black Kenya. I bred, okay, yeah, I bred China to Ritz and got Black Kenya, yeah. Um, uh, so down in the comments below, man, do me a favor, like, try, uh, put some names you think I should call these two females. I'm keeping both of them. Um, as well as don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and I mean you should have seen them earlier. I put this all white female in here, dude. She was having the male crying. And uh, he was, she was on top of him, just acting like she was biting him, and he was just squealing, man. Wife came out here talking about, who's getting, who, who's dying? I'm like, man, ain't nothing going on. Hey! Isabel, don't do that. Because when Snoop, Snoop don't like uh, getting pet around other dogs, so watch out. Because he'll snap at the other dog. So don't touch him. And the other dogs come up. I saw him just now. He looked at the other dog like, hold up, back up. Anyways, um, I got Snoop out here, man. My first bully I bought uh, back. Ooh, he's about, uh, he's about 12 years old. Uh, I think he just turned 12 this year, 11. But um, anyways, and he's an Amstaff. He's huge. But uh. But yeah, so we got these three right here, as you can see. The little male. Actually, he's bigger than all of them. He's still available. Located in Kentucky. If you need shipping, it's an extra $5.50. You're more than welcome to come pick them up yourself. Papers are in hand. I done shipped out two of the papers to two guys. And they should be getting them here real soon. They should be getting them by, hopefully, this weekend, if not today. But, um, yeah, I'd rather you come pick up in person. That way, you know, we don't have to worry about... Papers get lost in the mail. Isabel, what I tell you about that? You can't be petting other dogs around Snoop. Look at him. He's he's. Yeah, you can't pet him around other dogs because he's he's getting mad. He 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 was over there growling at that other dog or snarling. He ain't growling at him. I can see his face. Leave him alone. You can text me at 270 317-1952, $750 deposit. Uh, I accept deposits through cash app only. I gotta mess around and feed these guys. I, I cleaned their bands, gave them water. I'm about to be ready to feed them. But Barbie looked just like that lilac female right there. Except she didn't have no white in her face. She got a little bit of white on her on her forehead. But Barbie had no white. She had a white on her chest. I didn't think she had white on her paws. But um, now look at him being all submissive. See earlier, she was doing that. And he he just was rolling on his back, just squealing. And at first, I was out here cleaning bands and stuff, and I looked like, hold on, oh, here we go, here we go, cut it out. Don't you start. Um, now he's starting to get, now he's starting to growl. At first, he was squealing, acting like somebody was killing him. Like man, you better get up, shoot. But yeah, she looked just like Rosie. So I'm super excited um, to see what they do. Um, I'm really enjoying I'm about to highlight the Savage Pups. Um, nah, I think I'm going to wait on that. Because I was going to say I was probably going to highlight the Savage and Red Bull Pups. Because all of them are small. Red Bull, or the, Red, the Red Bull clone, he's small. But his siblings, dude.
they're even smaller. You know what I mean? And they're a couple months older than this litter right here. But this litter is way smaller. But then again, you know, you got Guap and Barbie. You know, we have Red Bull and Savage, which is pretty small. But the thing is, though, they're pretty small. But they're, you know, their their ancestors are big. You know, Grand Champion Chopper, standard. That's uh, Savage uh, Sire. Then you got Grand Champion El Toro. He's a standard, and he's uh, Red Bull's um, Red Bull's um, sire. Um, uh, then you you had uh, his mother, which was Mona freaking Lisa. Yeah, Mona freaking Lisa, because Mona freaking Lisa Jr. is a sister. Mona freaking Lisa, um, she was pocket, bro, and short bag and all. I talked to a, a DJ, which is the owner of Grand Champion Futuristic. And uh, I talked to him about how the rest of the litter turned out. Dude, the whole litter was standards and excels. He couldn't believe that she was so small, you know, when I told him, oh, man, look at this. Um, that that uh, she was so small. And I'm like, dude, I'm not playing. I know she's pocket because she, she was shorter than Venus. Um, and she was fully grown. And, uh, and, uh, so he showed me some of the pictures of the other litter mates, dude. Yeah, they were tanks, bro. They, they, they were, they were giants, um, compared to Mona freaking Lisa. Um, so, you know, like I said, genetics is a funny thing. Um, but I'm predicting, bro, I, you know, when I bred Red Bull with Two Savage, dude, I'm predicting they're gonna be tiny. Like I said, Red Bull, I gotta look it up, man. They gotta be around, they gotta be around five, four to, four and a half, five and a half months. Um, which these guys are three months. Um, so I, I, I'm really looking forward to seeing them, you know. Uh, once they hit six months, man, you'll be lucky, you know, with me, you know, with my bloodline that I've been looking at paying attention to. Once they hit six months, man, you'll be lucky if they grow an extra inch and a half. I, I'm saying they're they going to hit an inch and be done once they hit six months. So that's amazing. Yeah, matter of fact, I am going to show Red Bull tomorrow and a little blue try that I sold with the cleft palette. Uh, he's leaving here in December. Um... That that blue boy, the blue tribe with the clef. Oh my goodness, bro! He's six, about to be seven months. Got to be, because uh, his balls is about to drop. Or they're already dropping, but they're not all the way there yet. But he is tiny, bro. He is so small. And Red Bull is right there with him. Um, I think they might be about the same size. But the blue boy, dude, he he's just he's swole. He's just you know he's getting that that little teenager body on. Um, whereas Red Bull, he ain't hit it yet. So I'm really excited. About that. How Red Bull pops and turns out. She's just real timid, man. She's just letting them just do their thing. 